Hello my Spares, this is Keisha from Faith and Property. Happy New Year's guys. I was off YouTube for about one and a half year, but I'm back now. I did a Danielle fast this year and I wanted to share my daily experience and vision with you. So here we go for the first day. So for the first day, so I was preparing for this Danielle fast quite a while, for about a month. And it's my first time doing this Daniel fast. So I was preparing my mind mentally and spiritually. I was being preparing myself because I've never done a Daniel fast before. I have done a three day and a seven day fast, but I've never really done like Daniel fast itself. But it was a really good experience, guys. And for those who have not done it before, you should give it a try. Before you do so, just make sure that the Holy Spirit is leading you to do that. I will tell you the first night, the night before my fast started, I had um, a vision. And wow, wow. That's all I can say is this year is the year of Jubilee. It is the year of Jubilee. And that's what came into my spirit and it's been in my spirit ever since the first day of my fast. Yesterday was the last day of my fast and I decided to share you, with you guys my daily experience. So each day I will be sharing a day of the vision and my experience that night or that day. If you see me looking down it's because I write so I did a journal and I wrote some stuff down so I'm just going through it. So as I said and it's been in my spirit about the um the year of jubilee. It comes to me I never I briefly read about it in the Bible but I never understood it. And it came in my spirit. This is the year of jubilee, the year of jubilee. So I google it to see what does the year of jubilee means and it's actually in the Bible. So it says that every 50 years, there is an economic, cultural, environmental, and communal reset. This is when the land and the people rest, and all those who are in slavery are set free and return to their communities. Yeah! So it is a it's a it's a year of restoration. It's the year where the the slave was free every 50 years so every every seventh sabbath year which is every 50 years so that's what i learned over my research so for me i believe that this is the year that there is there's there is going to be supernatural debt cancellation for all those that are in debt it's going to be a supernatural year of debt cancellation. Why I choose that is because the Bible says in Proverbs um, 22 7, the rich rule it over the poor and the borrower is a slave to the lender. So the rich rule it over the poor and the borrower is a slave to the lender. So this is the year that supernatural debt cancellation is going to happen. This is the year for reset this is the year of jubilee that was what's been in my spirit throughout the entire 21 days of this fast my experience for the first night or the first night into the day of my daniel fast i'm so sorry i feel like there is hair in my eyes and my eyes is already like so i'm trying to get it trying to get it out but i dreamt and i'm gonna read some of it because um i don't that i had so many vision during this fast and I just wanted to break it down and give you guys from the first day what my vision was or what my dream. I dreamt that I ran into a friend that I grew up with. Um, this friend I grew up with, we went to school together in Jamaica. And I ran into her. I got this dream. In my dream, it's like a dream within a dream. So in my dream, I dreamt that I saw her opening up a business. I didn't share it with her. I didn't tell anyone about it. I actually now I actually run into the mall with so it's a dream within a dream I ran into the mall and I saw her and I saw her with uh, two other friends and they were um, an advertisement for a business for this luxury coffee shop juice bar kind of thing and it's just luxurious and it has like it was painted in green and black 
and you know green is prosperity and i ran into her and i saw her, i saw a couple of her friends and they were there and i was like oh so i said to her um is this your store she said not really i have shares in it my friends those two friends and i we are opening a store together so we're doing like an advertisement so we can advertise and then i was like oh my gosh i was so happy for her i'm so proud of you i dreamt it and i'm so sorry i didn't get to tell you were telling no one that i dreamt it because now this vision is coming to pass and i was crying because i was angry at myself because i did not share this vision with anyone so now telling someone that oh yes I dreamed that you were going to open this business it's like a lie and then i'm like okay i need to start sharing one that i got from this is that i need to share my vision i need to speak what god has laid upon my um my mind or the holy spirit spoken to me so while so within the dream in the dream i also saw her sat down and she was sitting down and um there was just money raining down just green money just raining down into her lap just raining down into her lap i was so happy for her i'm like this year you're gonna be blessed god god is gonna shake heaven he's gonna shake heaven and how pour his blessing over your life you're gonna be so prosperous and it's just prosperity 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 right through that night it's all about prosperity and when I got up, I started to write down, just, just journaling and just writing down. And then as I was writing down my dream in my journal, which you can see, I even used um, green pen to write it down. And I dated it. I'm not sure if you were able to see. It's kind of washed out. And so I started writing it down. And the old spirit has also put in my spirit that it's not only my friend that's going to be prospering this year that every entrepreneurs every small business people that has been sowing seeds into their business paying for advertisement um you know like paying tides you know sowing seeds towards their business just just paying to put your business that costing you money to um to put your business up to L llc or INC or limited business um, that this is your year it's the year of reset jubilee means the year to reset the year when your finance is going to be set free and God just want you to know it's the year of prosperity all you have to do is to trust him trust him trust him I'm sorry I love to repeat my words but God wants us to trust him. I am one of those people. I just started my own business. And this is speaking to me myself too. That not only my friend will be prospering this year. It's all of us that has been sowing seed into our business. This is the year of Jubilee. The year to, to reset. The year that the world reset. A lot of us thought that the reset, uh, the year had reset during COVID. No, this is the year, the, the year of Jubilee and the year when. So this is the year, guys, all you entrepreneurs, that money will be, money is going to rain down, rain down in your lap. I'm just going to say one thing to you guys. When that money started raining down into your lap, don't forget God. Don't forget God. Don't forget to help the needy and don't forget to tithe don't forget to speak an encouragement word to someone don't forget god don't forget to help someone because in helping you're helping god and in helping god god will release his blessing and rain down prosperity into your life so this is all that i have to say about my dream about my vision for that night that day it went well you know i was charged i was so charged because this dream just put me in a chargeable mode i i went on facebook and i started look, looking for this friend i put her name in and i sent her the message that god wants her to know that this year is going to be a year when of her prosperity and that money will be raining down into her, her lap. It took about about two weeks and she replied and say thank you. 
thanks for that you know guys hope you guys have a great day a great week a great month and for those that has not been following me this is my year for youtube and this is my year to come at you guys with all the visions that i've gotten during my 21 days of fast and this is my year that the the lord is going to use me on youtube so please subscribe share my videos to those who that needs to hear because god is downloading things in my head and i need to release it and i need it to get to the right people so i hope you guys share so it can go to the right people if you know anyone that is struggling in their business or struggling trying to build their business please share this with them so it can encourage them hope you guys have a great day a great week and a great month see you in my next video